Hello and welcome. I'm Raul Klingberg. If you're here visiting for your first time, you may or may not know me. Um, I am the designer and builder of the Klingberg Wing and the Klingberg Wing Mark II. Uh, if you've been here before, then you've probably been following along with the development of the Klingberg Wing Mark II. Uh, I did my original wing back in the mid 80s and the Klingberg Wing Mark II has been a follow-on which has been in development for actually about 10 years, uh, a long development timeline on that one. They're both uh, foot launch sailplanes. Uh, the Klingberg Wing original uh, was designed to have a 20 to one glide ratio and the Mark II somewhere in the 30 to one range. Uh, the development of the Klingberg Wing Mark II is mostly completed at this point and uh, we're waiting for better weather to do further flight testing with it. And in the meantime, uh, I thought, oh, I got some spare time on my hands. Let's start another flying wing design. And we'll call it the Klingberg Wing Mark III. I know that's not the most creative name in the world, but it just seems kind of self-evident. It's the next one in the lineage. Um, and I thought it'd be very interesting to invite my YouTube viewers to participate in the process. And you'd be able to follow with and participate in the development of a brand new flying wing design from scratch, right from the very beginning. And that starts today. Um, and you might ask, well, what's it going to be? And the answer is, I don't know yet. Tell you, tell me. Uh, I'm looking forward to having my uh, YouTube viewers uh, make comments and tell me what they think a really cool flying wing would be. Now, it's a given. It's going to be a flying wing because that's kind of what I do. It's my thing. Uh, but beyond that, I don't know. Is it another hang glider? Possibly. Uh, what type of hang glider? Is it one that folds up, goes on top of your car, has some flexible surface to it, like my original wing or like the Millennium? Or is it a rigid wing hang glider like I'm currently developing? And in what way is it different? What, in what way would it be groundbreaking or cool or more popular? Uh, and I don't have the answers to those questions because that's really driven by the public. Um, perhaps it's a powered aircraft of some kind. Uh, maybe it's an ultralight, powered, single seat, five gallons of fuel, something like that. Maybe it's not gas. Maybe it's electric. Uh, that's an up and coming thing. It, maybe it's a light sport aircraft. Maybe it's larger, could be electric or gas, but it carries two people and you have to have a sport license to fly it. Could be that too, or something entirely different. And will be made of metal or composites or wood, combination of all three. I don't know. That's I'm looking for input from my YouTube viewers. Um, and this is this something that's built to test new concepts, or is it something that's meant to be commercialized, either in plans for home builders or kits, or something that's ready to fly? I don't have those answers either. The one answer I do have is it will be a flying wing. And I would like to have the general public participate in the process. Uh, to aid in that participation, we have the comments in YouTube, uh, which you are free to make. And I may or may not look at them because I'm going to mostly focus on my Patreon site. I've set up a brand new Patreon site just for the people that are interested in this project and want to follow along. Now, uh, up front, free. You go to Patreon, I'll have public postings, you can participate for free. And uh, make comments, I'll read your comments. And if it's something interesting or thought-provoking or other people want to comment on it, uh, then we'll get a little bit more involved in answering your questions if you have them or just noting your comments, taking in the input. Um, if you want for sure to have your comments read and responded to, then you would subscribe uh, to Patreon. And uh, then you're guaranteed that your comments will be reviewed by me and uh, perhaps responded to. Uh, it depends on what level you subscribe at. There'll be multiple levels. Uh, at, at a certain level, you'll be able to subscribe and be guaranteed a response. Uh, there'll be a level where you can subscribe and I will uh, give you comments or assistance in your own designs, or you can just spectate. Uh, any of those are fine. And uh, I, if you're interested in this topic, I hope you 
uh, go down to the description in this YouTube video and click on the link, go over to Patreon, and at least at the beginning here, start reading for free and making comments, and I'll take those in, and it'll begin to shape the path that we go on together. Um, and you'll be uh, exposed to uh, the initial design process of making the decision of what's it going to be, what's it going to do, uh, why do we want to build this aircraft, uh, and what are the trade studies involved. So first of all, we have to decide what is the purpose of this new flying wing. And I really invite you to come and give your votes on what type of flying wing you would like to see uh, this design be, uh, its category, its usages, and any other thing that you think would be really cool on a flying wing uh, that you think other people would like or be interesting to try out. If you have ideas for uh, a particular area of structure or aerodynamics or propulsion uh, that you think is an area that deserves more study and further engineering development, that'd be very interesting also, uh, because this certainly will be an experimental aircraft, and that's a ripe opportunity to break new ground and try new things. Uh, so I welcome you aboard. I'm glad you're here. Please go over to Patreon and make some comments, drop your name in the bucket, and if you want to help bring this project to fruition and get us all the way to developing a new aircraft, then sign up, become a uh, patron with a pledge of one size or another. I welcome everyone, and I hope you enjoy the journey, and I look forward to hearing from you soon. As I always say at the end of my videos, fly safe and bye for now.